It now costs more than £100 to fill an average family car with petrol or diesel in the UK. And petrol prices have been hitting new record highs every day for the last month. So what is the reason for this? The first reason that fuel prices have increased sharply, is because the price for crude oil, which is used to make petrol and diesel, has substantially increased. Crude oil was cheaper at the beginning of the COVID pandemic, because many businesses temporarily closed and demand for energy collapsed. As life returned to normal, the demand for energy increased. But suppliers have struggled to keep up and so prices have risen. Another problem is that the oil used to make petrol is paid for in US dollars. The pound is weak against the dollar at the moment, which makes fuel in the UK even more expensive. Another reason for increased prices is that when crude oil prices move, petrol and diesel prices usually follow. But petrol retailers don't always pass on all of the reductions to their customers immediately, or in full. Another reason is that Russia is one of the world's largest oil exporters, but sanctions are being introduced. The US has announced a complete ban on Russian oil imports. The UK is to phase out Russian oil by the end of the year, and EU leaders say they will block most Russian oil imports by the end of 2022. This means demand for oil from other producers has increased, leading to higher prices. And although the UK imports just 6% of its crude oil from Russia, it is still affected when global prices rise. So when will petrol and diesel prices come down? Fuel prices are unlikely to come down until other oil producers are able to increase supplies to compensate for the loss of Russian oil. So it is probable that petrol and diesel prices will continue to rise over the coming months, continuing the trend from the past year. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, subscribe, and share. Please also consider clicking the thanks button. Thank you.